Warning, the following video may contain disturbing content to some viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. You have been warned. What do you think? Good idea? Look, I'm shredding it up. Oh, man. I even noticed it. Oh, will it? Will it? So what has Corona been up to? Well, Corona has been eating all of the minnows. The COVID squad has officially shrunk down to about five or six. Now, these are the female ones. They are way bigger than the other small male ones that are a lot easier for the baby bass to swallow. We are going to have to go to the store and pick up some food specifically for you. So we are on the way to the pet store right now to go pick up some food for Corona the baby bass. Oh, would you look at that? I just noticed. Look at that box. Wow. We're here, let's go get that food. Crickets, crickets, crickets on my mind. Just open this one too, hope they stay open after all this corona stuff. Don't touch anything, don't touch anything, don't touch anything nice, clean. Well, super small and then medium. Okay, um, how, how small are they super small? Uh, those are actually good. If I can get uh, just like five or six of those. Five or six? Yeah, and then a dozen of the large ones, please. Okay. Thank yeah. you. It's good. I mean, people do want to come in for business, but at the same token, it's a social distancing that people do want to stay away, you yeah. know? Yeah. Of course. Baby bass. Oh, baby bass. Baby bass, yeah. Wow. Yeah. I hear that too often. Yeah, it's about the size of one of the rosy red minnows you guys have. Really? Yeah, it's tiny. Yeah. Oh. Some stuff. We caught some rosy red minnows for it, but it ate all the males, but all the females are too big no for it to actually swallow, yeah. All right, so I got six for the baby bass, and I just picked up a bunch for the bearded dragon, Miss Gimp. But these will be the main focus of the video today. So I came back to the shop because I definitely needed a little cricket carrier. The shop's been closed for a week. Nobody can get a haircut, social distancing people. This is perfect just in case all the crickets are not eaten. Goodbye, shop. Goodbye, chomper. So we've actually been closed now all week at the shop. It's been very sad. Been social distancing and had to shut down my local business, my small business, so that's no fun. I'm gonna miss working. At least I get to come and feed my fish a couple times. <laughs> but that's it. Back to go feeding Corona. So as a result, the bass has not been eating daily, has been eating now every other day. So we went to the store and picked up, hello in there, jump scare. Now Corona has found a new little spot where it likes to dwell and hide after a full belly. And it seems its belly is a little full, so it may have eaten something, but we're still gonna go ahead and drop a cricket in here to see if Corona will react. All right, I just went and grabbed one out with my hand. I'll go ahead and put it in here. We're gonna see. Did it fall in? Yep, there it is. Right there. Will Corona discover this cricket? We'll soon find out, because it's definitely full of motion. Yeah, this bass doesn't seem to be moving out of this little new spot that it found, and now we have this cricket. Oh, the minnows are looking at it. Uh-oh. Got the minnows checking it out. That's not the goal here. We are not looking for minnows to play around with this little cricket that we got. We want the bass. But if you're not gonna give it to us, the show must go on. Now I got these two crazy little fish that will absolutely eat one, probably even a bigger cricket. So we're gonna go ahead and drop one in and see if they'll, these are saltwater fish. So we'll actually see if they're gonna go ahead and tear one up. The chosen cricket to sacrifice. Here we go. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Dropping in. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, look at him shredding it up. Oh, man. Dude. Oh, did you like it? Did you not like it? Oh, they seem to like it. The sergeant hasn't even noticed it. Oh. Oh, where'd it go? You just ate the whole thing? Oh, it's up in the corner now. It's 
almost like they don't even know how to eat it or what to do with it. It's still swimming around though. It's actually still alive through all of this. So even if Corona doesn't eat it in this video, we'll have future content for the next video. But we still have the other big sergeant that was healing up with its tail nip that this one probably will take a cricket with no problem. And there's gobies. These gobies are very hungry at all times. So let's give this one a shot. Oh! Oh, the, the other goby came out too. Sergeant doesn't know what to do or how to act, doesn't know what's going on. Let's see if the goby actually eats it though. They're like toying with it. And this sergeant doesn't seem too interested. It's more curious about what it is. It's like, what is it? But as far as tearing it apart or ripping it up like how I thought, I don't know. It doesn't seem too, too voracious. Do you just prefer the sinking pellets instead? Oh, there you go. Going crazy. Here comes the gobes. Get him, gobes. See, even that goby's a victim of that sergeant with a little tail nip on the side of it. Or it could have been the other goby as well. We don't know. This is a very aggressive tank for these little guys. And pellets for you lovely ones, of course. Oh, what? Look at them eat. for the mother load a little calcium powder as a salad topper here a little shaker up will do miss gimp here will show you no hesitation as far as eating she'll even come right up to this this little feeding tub we have right here come here mama she's looking already she thinks i dropped some ready yeah, she loves her crickets. She loves her crickets. We don't feed crickets too often, so these are considered treats. Always greens and whoa! Superworms and waxworms. But these crickets, she absolutely loves these. Oops, drops them on your head. Sorry. Get them, get them. Let me help you. All right, I think I'm gonna set these aside 
just in case the pet stores close later on this week. What do you think? Good idea? Oh, how could I resist? All right, a couple more. If you guys like these feeding videos and you like our animals, please make sure to like this video, share it with your friends, smash that like button, hit the notification bell button below so you see all the new videos that we post with our animals. Stay adventurous, stay safe out there with this coronavirus. Please wash your hands, social distance, and as always, A1A Adventures. When I just thought of something, I actually want to see if a goldfish will eat one because a goldfish will eat anything. You ready to eat a cricket goldfish? All right, here we go. Shoot! Get in there. Oh, no. All right, got it. Almost had a runner. Will the goldfish eat it? Will the goldfish eat it? The grommy's staring at it. Oh, will it? Will it? Will it? Will it? Oh! Goldfish, you're the one for the win. You're the only one out of all these fish that actually ate one of these crickets. You are the bomb diggity. Oh, that is awesome. Goodness. Do you need more to eat? I mean, boom. Enjoying that, chewing it up. Is the cricket still moving around? And, and you didn't even spit it out. You're a champ. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Yeah, I definitely think you were the one that ate that minnow we had in here.